Okay, here we go. Another wrap up. Yes, from the EMA, which is Electronic Merchants Association. That's what that said. Let's see. The Home Media Expo in Las Vegas. Yeah. Yeah. Boy, it was at the Palms Hotel. And boy, has this been. Well, what do you think? It's been rather interesting. Well, there's some interesting things, you know, like, uh, okay, like this, this is extremely interesting because I don't know if you can really see it closely with the camera. Uh, that's that's this, Jumper, that's a digital copy. That's a digital copy. And a digital copy is a, a simple, fast, portable. With digital copy, enjoying portable version of your favorite film has never been easier. Simply transfer the included file to your PC, iPod, or other compatible player. Don't count on the Zoom. <laughs> <laughs> they have the Microsoft won't make a deal for Zoom, so it's one of the reasons why Zoom is probably tanking. But uh, get your entertainment fix when you want, where you want it. Basically, we saw it in action. What do you think about it? It's uh, well. Theoretically, I mean, this this copy here, which is Jumper, is what Fox is pushing, and it's uh, is you basically you use uh, you, you got to have an iTunes account, <laughs> which oh you do? Yeah. Why do you have to have an iTunes account? Because you can't download it without an iTunes account. To Are you it. serious? Well, mostly yeah. Okay. Because you um, it, it, this this was designed for iTunes. It will work with a Windows Media Player, hmm. or it works with um, you know like an iPod things like that. But you have to. You have to. It, it takes a little bit longer for Windows Media Player than it does for iTunes for who knows what reason. But you simply you um, you you take a, 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 a password they give you. You feed it into the your computer, and it allows this to make from the copy here. You don't go online to do it. You just have to go online to activate it. So. Wait a minute. On digital copy, I think one of the things a couple of years ago at some of these trade shows, yeah. we were talking about how people were upset because they had to buy one copy for to watch for the DVDs, yeah, one for well, their uh, yeah, this one, PSP or for you yeah, know their that, iPhone or other devices. Like this, you have a, you have a, a, you know like a, lap, a desktop computer and a laptop computer and maybe one portable device, but you can't copy from any of those things. And if only has. Uh, you know, from the time you buy it to the, you know, it has about a year's exploration on it. But from the time you register it, if you don't use it, then you lose it. Right now they're working oh. on trying to expand it. But that's it. they said that the technology that makes this work is in its infancy. And they said that in six months it is probably going to be changed. But, you know, everybody basically is getting to test drive this at the moment to see how it does work. Well, we're going to test it, but this is actually kind of interesting, yeah. a digital copy. So by buying this, you can watch it on... You can watch it on other devices. Different devices. You can it's take not a, just for your you know, DVD player. No, no. You're not, not, it can be put on your computer. It can be put on a, you know, any, any, it can put on an MP3 iPod. player, iPods, anything that has video capabilities it can be loaded to. That's pretty good. And it should, they said, three to four minutes to load it. But it's loading from this, not from online, it's loading from the DVD there. The, the, the other copy is stuck in the system. It actually cuts down one of the problems that people have, which are the download copies, right? right? Which takes and, forever. And they, they remember, if you if this is not going to, from what I understand, it's a standard definition that you would find on a regular DVD download. So it's not this a high may def. be a high def, but it's not going to come out in high def because okay. that's one of the bugs. Well, it does say Jumper 2D White 20. Is it 20? 20th century 2D. Fox. It's 2D, but uh, 2D. Which means it's a standard <laughs> definition. Okay. Yeah. Well, you know what? You were talking about the expiration of the date of this. It also reminds me of these DVDs right here. Actually, can you oh. reach it? Because uh, okay. okay, these balloons. I'm having fun with them, but you got to be a little bit careful. I know. Okay, this is a. Uh, oh, hold on. Before we do that, there's also there's those other two other digital copies that we have. Yeah, two others. Family Guy and. Hitman? Hitman. You know, they're, they're coming out with more on a, as fast as they possibly can. But, um, you know, right, right now this is still an experiment because people have said they want it. Fox has given it to them to see if it works. Hmm. I personally think that it's not going to. Because we'll try it out. You never know. We're going to try it out. You're going to get to see whether it does work or not. But uh, we, we've got these. And similar to the other ones that have an expiration date, so do these. What is this, flex play? So this is a little bit different than Netflix, right? That's right. Basically, they, uh, they, you sell, they sold a DVD that has a very 
limited lifespan. You know, open the, the sealed inner package, activate the DVD, watch it two days of unlimited playing, and then basically throw it away, which is basically not green. And definitely well, not a green. It does thing. tell you to recycle it. Yeah, but it tells you to recycle it. Or discard when you But how, how do you recycle a DVD? I don't know, because I, you don't... They aren't worth anything. Well, I don't know how you recycle it. You, I guess you can't really donate it to a library. No, because, because it's no good. It's just no longer useful. Do you put it in a recycle bin? I don't know. I should take, put it in a recycle thing. There's, I don't know what they would use. Maybe they crunch them all up and make the, you know, use the mineral material out of again. But I've never seen that done. This is a company, FlexPlay, yeah. so we'll have to check out more on that. Now this was, since we're talking about packaging and organic, made me think of this company called GPAC. And they, it says, introducing the 100% recyclable. Now here's the important part, CD, DVD package. So, and I asked him, he said, you're looking at it kind of strange. And I said, well, um, I said, what about the DVD? He said, or the CD? He said, well, that's not recyclable, but the packaging is. But see, that's the problem. That's the key. That's what? why the word. You can recycle up. paper. No, he said the D, the DVD mm -hmm. is not recyclable. It says right there recycle. But we've got the people that are doing the packaging said it's not recyclable. Yeah, I don't. It says on here by let's see, by producing fifty thousand cases using new leaf metamorphosis made with seventy percent post consumer waste. Yeah. Waste. Okay, you save. 64 fully grown trees. But they should make it out of total consumer waste. By 64%. No, no, no. 64% and you save 64 trees. Oh. With, with, um, oh, made with 70% post consumer waste. It should be 100%. It should be 100% because you get, oh. you, know, it, you know, even when they make newspaper, when they make um, paper, they're taking old paper to make new paper. I mean, you can, you can, you can recycle. Uh, Blue jeans in the material in the paper. So. No, it says 100% recyclability up to, and it's made up to 70% post consumer waste. Which basically is not 100%, that's 70. Right. So post consumer waste. Yeah. Well, I know. See, we're, yeah. we're getting there. It's, you know Do that you green thing? It's like green is like. Okay, green is like trying to, trying to be green is like trying to find Never Never Land. It's a place that everyone wants to go to but find it hard to get there. Okay. So anyway, they're working on it. Here's, here's, oh wait, Polly Shore is Natural Born Comics. We saw Polly Shore last night with his father Sammy. Oh, actually, that was pretty funny. Now, Polly Shore is Home Media Entertainers. Um, Comedian of the Year or something. Yeah. No, Comedy Entertainer. Comedy Entertainer of the Year. Year. Uh, yeah, okay. How did he be Comedy Entertainer of the Year? Well, he's basically got a comedy album out, and he's there to pick up the award. <laughs> This is about natural born comics. Yeah. Well, he's, well, well, he's actually a nice guy. You know, he's just, you know, he basically he's had the many, many careers of Polly Shore, and he's still a young person. And after seeing him on stage with his dad, you, know, you can see where he got it from. His father, it, imagine Polly Shore on steroids, and you, you know, or, you know, he got his father. You know, he's really wired. Could you imagine what his father was like? Was his father well, he used on stage? To, his father used to work open for a, you know, the big singer. You know, he opened for Elvis Presley. Oh, he did. Right. Okay, so this is coming out natural. Polly Shore's Natural Born Comics. Yeah. Sketch comedy book. You'll have to pick that one up. Yeah, and then the, uh, we also we got we attended awards ceremony yesterday. Many, many awards given to people, all of them that just happen to have, okay, we got... Uh, they have movies coming out. Movies coming out, you know, like John Shell, Breakout Director of the Year, well, he, he is, he, well actually, We've not movies as much coming out as they got all DVDs coming out. Well, and the reason for that is this is home media entertainment. It's you, got to do with DVDs. Right, and it's all about DVD releases, so these are all movies. Yeah. Not all movies, sometimes you know, documentaries, uh, but they're DVD you know, releases. Jamie Kennedy, who is the host of the show, has Hecker coming out on DVD. Yep. Ed Bagley Jr. has um, Living with Ed. Living with Ed. Uh, John Chow has a uh, step, you know, stepping to, to. Yep. Cam Gabriel, Cam Gadjanet, raising us over here. He has, you know, his um, movie coming out. Also, he has to find these things. Oh wait, here's the thing. Here's Heckler. Oh, okay, there's Heckler right Is it, there. Here's for Heckler. Here, that's for Heckler. Yep. But. Uh, Got uh, Cam, yeah, Cam's in that. We basically got a deal. <laughs>